For over 50 years, DeWills has been a family-owned and operated manufacturer of fine custom cabinetry. They use a variety of eco-friendly materials and strive to build a product that's healthier for your home and the planet. Beginning as a small cabinet shop, their commitment to quality, craftsmanship, and business integrity has never been compromised. We visited Arista Kitchen showroom in Bethpage on Long Island to speak with DeWills CEO Tracy Wilson. He gave us some insight into DeWills and what sets them apart. The history of DeWills uh, started with my father in 1959. He founded the company. He worked for the phone company during the day and built cabinets on weekends and at night until he was able to do it full time. My brother and I, Randy, we've grown up in the business doing pretty much everything along the way. We've owned and operated the company since the late 80s. Uh, our children currently are involved in the business now in a significant way and we hope to carry this on for generations to come. The thing that most significantly sets us apart from other brands is that we're a true custom manufacturer. Everything we do is custom made to order for our customer, but we manufacture the whole product from beginning to end. We do all of our own casework, we do all of our own frame stock, uh, drawers, and including doors. Most manufacturers will buy their doors from outside from a door plant. Uh, by doing it ourselves, uh, we can assure not only the quality, but also the value. Uh, we have a cost advantage over those who are buying from outside sources. Another significant case is that so much of what is upgrades in other cabinet lines is standard features for DeWills. The all plywood case work, the wood dovetail drawers, the full extension guides, soft close hinges, soft close drawers. Those are all things other companies charge extra for. They're things that we do as a standard. We do it that way over and over again and we're more efficient at it and that's one of the ways that people get a better value from DeWills. DeWill's craftsmanship and dealer support make owning a new kitchen easy, fun, and enjoyable from imagination to installation. The process of getting a new DeWill's kitchen really starts with you and what your dreams for your individual space are. You need to really focus on a door style, a color, a look and feel for your kitchen. Communicate that with your DeWill's dealer who will do a computerized drawing for you of your individual space and show you exactly what your kitchen will look like uh, before it's installed. The response to DeWills here in New York has been unbelievable. New Yorkers who are interested in frameless cabinetry really love our tilt-up hardware, the variety of styles and finishes that are available in this line, the stainless steel drawers, the newest in European fittings and interior technology, New Yorkers have also responded well to our traditional framed cabinetry, which features dovetail drawers, all plywood construction, and again, a lot of the same uh, interior accessories and features that you find only in America's finest cabinetry. DeWills is the smart, stylish, and eco-friendly choice for your kitchen and is available through a network of independently owned and operated dealers throughout the Northeast. DeWills is available in this showroom, Arista Kitchens, located in Bethpage, New York. It's also available throughout the five boroughs and in every county in the region. You can go to our website, DeWills.com, to locate the DeWills dealer nearest you and also order a brochure from our company. The people in New York have responded very well to DeWills, uh, as evidenced by the fact that it's the fastest growing market we have in the entire country. The people of New York expect value, reliability, and quality, and that is what DeWills is all about. Custom design, old world craftsmanship, all wood construction, superior value. When you choose DeWills, you're buying a high quality product backed by a family run company dedicated to environmental responsibility. This is Bob Barnes reporting for A Taste of New York.